Today I want to help you improve hitting your fairway woods off the ground. I find most of my students find it quite easy to hit their fairway wood off a tee. As soon as we get the ball off the deck, it becomes much harder. And actually their swings do change from time to time in an effort to get that ball up in the air, okay? So let's think about this. What are we trying to do? Well, we're trying to swing the golf club in a circle around the body, okay? And as we swing in, in this circle, the club is going to bottom out at the ground and then it's going to swing around our body on the follow through. And the most common fault I see generally is amateurs topping their three wood or even their five wood, okay? We know five woods are a bit easier to hit. Um, and I would advise if you are having a fitting perhaps that a five wood is, is a good starting point, definitely easier to hit. But if you're looking for that extra yardage with a three wood, think about what we're trying to do. We're trying to hit slightly down on a three wood, okay? And, and most problems occur when people are trying to sweep up, trying to help it up in the air and people really treating it too much like a driver, okay? And people generally get that ball too far forward in the stance, they are bottoming out too early and coming up and topping the ball. So the easiest change you can initially make is in this ball position, okay? So I'd say to people, you know, the ball should be about a club head inside your heel line, okay? So get that club head inside the heel line and then that ball is just sitting perfectly exactly, exactly where we want it, okay? That's going to allow me to hit slightly down and, and even in a case you know perhaps even taking a small divot uh, isn't out the out of the question okay so let's try that first so first of all we're going to get our feet together small step with the left foot a bit bigger with the right foot then all we're going to try and do is almost feel like we're hitting slightly down on that wood and we can get a nice strike and a lovely shot down the middle there okay the second point I want to bring up is in the backswing, okay? So most people that do struggle tend to just pick up with the arms, okay? I don't see enough people turning their back to the target. So as you swing to the top, I want you to feel like your back is facing the target. You're gonna get a nice full shoulder turn and it's gonna allow you to shallow that club exactly how you want to. People that tend to pick it up, they just come across it, get really steep on it, and we know it's super hard to hit a three wood like that. So think about getting that full rotation to the top of the swing and the back to the target. Okay, so in position, nice big turn to the top. And we get that lovely strike away with the three wood. Okay. And again, for me, there's one final super simple tip that anyone can apply. And that's keeping it smooth. Keep it easy. Keep it nice and smooth. I say to people, treat the swing speed of your three wood like you're hitting a pitching wedge, okay? The club is going to do the work, okay? So don't be, don't be trying to force it. The, the club is longer, there's less loft, there's, there's clearly a lot more meat around the head. And let that club do the work where you can just swing nice and easy and the ball's gonna travel, okay? It's gonna do exactly what you want it to do. So good ball position, Nice big turn and keep it nice and smooth. Try not to force it. And we'll get that nice strike down the middle of the fairway, exactly what you are looking for. Three super simple tips. It's helped a lot of my students over the years. It can definitely help you too.